everything he can within the law to make sure that the decision as to what marriage means is a decision that will be made by the people of Iowa and not a handful of judges. And you can rest assured that deep within his soul, God still knows that marriage, the definition of it, hasn't changed and that no earthly judge has a right to make that decision all by themselves. I'm grateful that Bob has the courage of his convictions. I know that here is a person who believes that life begins at conception and will do everything he can to protect human life. Those are issues that matter to me, and those aren't just political issues. They're deeper than that. And I know that here's a guy who knows what it is to sign the front of a paycheck. Wouldn't that be a novel idea to have somebody in the government? <laughs> If your state is like most, the overwhelming bulk of your state treasury is spent on education. Having someone who understands it from the inside is going to be a big boost because there's no point in spending millions and millions and millions of dollars if you don't want to have accountability for how it's being spent and to make sure that the money that's being spent is not about the schools, it's about the kids in those schools and that everything is done on their behalf, not to perpetuate the institutions, but to elevate the possibilities for every student in every school in Iowa. This guy gets it, and he'll be a part of making sure that that happens. I just want you to know that you have an opportunity to be a part of a campaign from the ground up, and I hope that you will give him your time, your money, your prayers, your hours of volunteer spirit, Make sure that if he comes to this area, or whether it's a parade or an event, that hundreds of people are there cheering and scaring the daylights out of every one of his opponents. That's always a good thing. <laughs> and on the night that he takes the stage along with Darla to accept not just your nomination, but your election as the next governor, you're going to know that you have a part in helping to shape the future of this wonderful state. And that your efforts, even here tonight, are going to be a part of the launching pad for giving him the opportunity to give you true leadership. Leadership you can be proud of and leadership which reflects the views and the values of the people of Iowa. Thank you tonight for coming. God bless you. God bless you.